Testing for COVID-19 in Kano State is about to get easier with the donation of a thousand capacity mobile testing center by the Aliko Dangote Foundation. The foundation is optimistic that the laboratory will make a big difference in the state after recording some of the highest cases in the country, sometimes overtaking Lagos and the FCT in daily records. This lab that we're presenting today um, will be able to test 400 people a day, so 400 tests a day, ramping up to 1,000 tests a day in the next two weeks. The reason why this is important is because, as you all have heard, we've had this shortage of testing here. We will pay for everything related to the lab. In the meantime, Director General of the Nigeria Center for Disease Control, Dr. Chikwe Hekwazu, allays fears over the spread of the coronavirus in Kano State, giving an assurance that the pandemic will be contained. I will mobilize every possible resource available to us. And when I say us, I don't mean the federal government or PTF, every resource in the country to support the work they are doing. Only just days ago, the Kano State Governor, Abdullahi Ganduje, had raised concerns that religious and cultural beliefs may aid the spike in cases. But this donation, in addition to the NCDC's 400 tests per day, appears to have eased some of those worries. We have 44 local governments, and we will ensure that each local government, the rural local government, that is 36 local government, will have each a collection centre. But here in the eight metropolitan local governments, we'll have hundreds of collection centers because this is where the majority of the population is. With 342 COVID-19 cases recorded in over three weeks, Kano has overtaken the FCT with the second highest number of cases in the country.